Hi everybody, this is Judy at Judy in the Kitchen. Today we're talking about honey nut squash and how to prepare and cook them. Well, before you get ready to cook them, you certainly want to give them a solid washing. You do want to wash them, after all, they're grown on the ground, so they might have some soil and bacteria or whatever lingering on them, so you want to wash them first. And then, let's say you, you can cook them any way that you would cook any winter squash. So they can be roasted, baked, sauteed, steamed, boiled. But the ideal way to cook a honey nut squash, a way that will intensify that wonderful sweet flavor, would be to roast it. So to roast your honey nut squash, all you need to do is first give it a good wash and then cut the stem end off. It'll make it a little bit easier to slice lengthwise. Then with a spoon, you want to remove the seeds and that stringy matter that's in the, the bulbous extended end of it. And then place it cut side down on a baking sheet or baking pan of some sort. A glass baking pan would be an ideal way to bake it, but if not, you can put it on any baking tray that you've got uh, lining it with parchment paper does help to make cleanup a little easier, but it's not mandatory. You do not need to slather the thing with oil. You don't need to do that with any winter squash, actually. So you can just put it cut side down, clean and dry, on a baking sheet, line it with parchment paper if you want to, put it in the oven at 375 or 400 degrees, 375 would be fine actually, and it will um, help to keep from burning that outer skin as much as if it were at 400 degrees, and just allow it to roast in there until it is soft enough to be poked with a fork and then take it out of the oven and allow it to cool down so that you can handle it and then with a spoon scoop out that wonderful pulp with it. Now the skin of the honey nut squash is edible so it's your choice on whether or not you want to eat it but again it's a matter of texture and personal preference. If you want to you can also quickly cook these things in the microwave on the baked potato setting. So that's another way that you can cook a honey nut squash in a hurry. And one squash is usually considered a serving for two people. So you can cook it, split it in two, and put it on your plate and adorn it in any way you want. And it would make a very interesting side dish in so many ways. Well, I do hope this helps you out. This is Judy at Judy in the Kitchen. Bye for now.